Welcome back, guys. So, I've conquered a lot of the map. All I've got left is Trois Riviers and these three forts. And we've just got another naval invasion. Oh, sorry. They uh, had a rebellion in Welmesuk and they took Madnaguk and Nordiwuk with the rebellion. So, I've got to deal with that as well. But they've had another rebellion, er, another rebellion, another naval invasion, and I've managed to catch it. Now we've got two first rates and this crappy ship that I've just captured. So I'm only going to engage, uh, get a chance to engage it once before it lands. So let's see how much damage we do. So two first rates and this crappy ship should be enough to sink all of them really you would have thought so anyway Well, that was beautiful. That was absolutely beautiful. So, I had my ship on destruction that time. Search for enemy ships. So, I don't know if it made any difference. But I had to fight a couple of battles of the ships that were already in the region. So, luckily I already had my ships in Boston at the time. So, it's. I don't know whether it would have been better to have one in Boston... One of the first rates. And one in Newport in case they landed down there. But I don't know how one ship would get on. To be honest with you. In one first rate ship. I don't know how much damage it would do. We could try and test it out. If you bear with me. I'll see if I can get an engagement with it. With just one ship. Well I think I managed to engage him. As soon as I saw him. Which is pretty cool. So, putting it on destruction definitely seems to help. It did help that he was sailing in that direction, even without me telling him to. So, I just put him on destruction. He sailed this way. This one sailed this way. So, you are kind of at the mercy of RNG, I think. But, we've got two first of the lines. Luckily, the freshest one is the one that's engaged. So, let's see how much damage he does. Okay, so apparently he only did 4,000 damage, which clearly isn't good enough. So you need at least two first-rate ships, and it looks like he has managed to land that time. So it looks like you need two first-rate ships, and we might have even needed this ship in there. So we could try it again, taking this ship out, and see if two first-rates is good enough. So I'll see if I can get that to happen. Okay, we've managed to engage him with two first rates, so let's see how this gets on.
Well, there we have it. Two first rates seems to be the magic number. One first rate didn't quite cut the mustard. But two first rates, marvellous. Okay, there you have it. Experiment fulfilled. Cheers for watching, take care, I shall see you soon.